Here's something I've been doing. I started on June 16th and they said there's a problem with my audio. So I did that, fixed it. They canceled that test, but they paid me. And then on the 22nd, I had one, two, three, four tests. And one of them said is the problem with the audio. And it's passed the test when I started, so I don't know what happened. But they paid me for it. They gave me four stars because of the issue. And then this one just completed, gave me four bucks, didn't say nothing. This one, seven bucks, didn't say nothing. It got canceled, so I don't know. It might have been an issue if one of them had shut down because it wouldn't go no further. This one was satisfied with whatever I did. That one was satisfied with whatever I did. No comments. And this one's pending payment to completed. They hadn't said nothing yet, so I don't know. I'm pretty sure how they, they blocked me for a week after I did the, um, the first test and they evaluate it and then they let you, okay, you did good enough so we'll let you through. So the first test must have been okay, it's just the audio wasn't great. And so then they, for some reason, I don't know what this one's from, but they threw it on here. It's from June 30 and it canceled and they gave me one star and no explanation. And I don't know if it has something to do with, because I had one test, I got all the way to the end. And I turned it in because I couldn't finish it. The last part was I had answered like three questions or something, and it froze up and wouldn't go back or forward or nothing. And I'm like, I'd rather y'all just keep your money than pay, give me that one star for that. I'm new. You know, I'm just learning. If it's something I did, then, you know, that's the problem. If it's your software, then it's you, you know. So this is basically what I got. No, June 14th, I guess was my first one. That's the one where it, I had to cancel it and I turned it in like I supposed to and they gave me half credit for it and said it wasn't my fault. So anyway, so you can see with pretty much a week and then four or five days of being blocked from June 16th I've made it'll be $96. So I can see where you possible to make $200 a month. Pretty easy, probably. It's not a whole lot of time. I'm slow when I speak and stuff, so the test probably takes me a little longer than most people. But anyway, that's a way to make you a little extra cash if you need to. I don't know how you do taxes on it because it'll be. They sent it to a PayPal. So I'm assuming PayPal, you can get you some type of W-2 form at the end of the year to show what money came in and then just add that in on your taxes and you'll just have to pay taxes on it then. Anyway, I just thought I'd show you this is what I've been doing sometimes just to make a little extra money. But it's not, not a bad deal. Let me see, there's a test popped up. So which of the following describes your work stats? Okay, I'm full time. Which of the following just describes your position at your job? Employee with no direct reports. Manager and senior. So I get well I, I do have to report to but it's not my I'm going to have to put that because I don't really so, so you get locked out there when you get a lot of those before you get one you're accepted in just so you know but it's really not that bad but anyway give it a try if you want to see if you can make a little bit of extra money if you ain't got much going on but anyway thanks for watching we'll see you
see you.